through hard work, grease, and delicious beef, Kansas City Barbecue has been ribbied up since 83. Well, my wife and I moved back out here from Kansas and we were kind of getting missed the smell and the taste of barbecue from the Midwest. So we opened this kind of a side light and a hobby. Probably more lunch business and dinner business at the time because not too many people live downtown. As geese fly south in the winter, one goose flew southbound in 1989, changing Kansas City Barbecue forever. For years we were known as the sleazy bar scene from Top Gun, and we still are. So it, it was busy at the time, but we still get a lot of visitors and, and conventioners and dignitaries in here uh, that's helped a lot. Although many may say this restaurant has some of the best service in San Diego, Kansas City Barbecue never forgets the real service of our boys and girls overseas. We've always had a strong relationship with the Navy and every Thanksgiving we've always had a free Thanksgiving dinner for any active duty military in town. Mm -mm. With such great food and people all in one plain area, it's no surprise that San Diegans are top gunning for these ribs. It's really kind of a melting pot. The airline people are in here and tourists, and it all seems to mix together and you meet some really interesting people. And as Charlie lost that love and feeling, San Diego and its lots of rib lovers feel the need, the need for more than just speed, but the need for Kansas City barbecue. For Student Television Network, I'm Kyle Messinger reporting. So it's just been kind of the intermingle and, and mix of, of all the different people we've had come through here. Uh, it's been a lot of fun.